So Isabel was saying, I brought saying? up her. Can you're you tell me? that we're going to pay for it. Hey, you're not social distancing. Sorry. I told Christine to maintain her social distance was because she's been traveling. Since the pandemic has hit, Cody is in a really bad place mentally and emotionally because he's having trouble getting wives to agree with him on what to do as far as COVID and how to handle it. He's having one issue after another with them, and then also they're not uh, working with him on things, so he can't go see them as much. Because I'm sticking to what it is that he wants to do as far as COVID, um, I'm seeing him the most. He's worried about the unity of his family. And this is just, just saying that we'll pay whatever the insurance doesn't pay for. Cody and I have been struggling for a while. We're not close. It was actually painful emotionally to be there, to be honest. It's hard to see him with everybody. It's really hard to see him in functional marriages when we don't have one. It sucks. It's terribly awkward. It's just the place that Christy and I are in. We're in, in a terribly awkward place. This is not uh, 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 the experience of people who are soulmates or people who even love and respect each other in a deep way. This is an experience of, of distance. Cody and I are not getting better. It's been bad for a long time. I would love it if Cody could come for Isabel's sake. But for me, I don't care that he's not gonna be there. I think us being separated for a while for this month might be good. Isabel was saying the other day she wished you could come. And, and I uh, said, you know, he would come if it wasn't for COVID. Time. But hey, it's happening now and the time's right and she's learned to endure, so we're yeah. good. Yeah, she's fine with it though, she gets it, she understands. Okay, She's All not right. frustrated with it. Have a good trip. Thank you. See ya. See you. I'm just having regret because the whole damn situation is breaking my heart. The whole thing with Isabel going and doing the surgery and the whole thing with my family and this disparity in behavior during COVID. It's really, really, really hard on our family.